Check it out. That's a dungeon. We're gonna have to go into that dungeon. And we're gonna have to beat bitches. You see that big tower? The locals are saying that thing up and came out of the ground? Whoa, whoa, how is that? What the fuck is happening? Why is... Why are the laws of physics and nature being fucked with? Is this the really big thing you told me over the phone? More excellent detective work, Narumi. I was researching that tower and came across the local Ishigami Cho lore. And they say the giant catfish that lives beneath Ishigami Cho and causes earthquakes. That there's a giant catfish. What? Funky. Just like that. And people here seem to think those quakes are being caused by the giant catfish. That tower is supposed to pin down the giant catfish so it doesn't cause any trouble. Kind of like spiking an eel's eye to the cutting board to prepare it for cooking. Oh my god! Oh. Huh, so that tower is acting like a spike to stop the giant catfish from thrashing around. Eh, you're too good a guesser. You're starting to steal my thunder here. Sorry, Ty. Keep going. So with the ground popped up out of so with the tower popped up out of the ground like that, the giant catfish is loose. What the fuck do you expect me to do about it? Uh, and that's supposedly the cause of these quakes we're feeling. But what I think is this kind of folklore, it's actually a warning to future generations about mystical phenomenon. Phenomenum, a warning. This is just my hunch, but the lore Ishigami that the, uh, the Lord Ishigami that the folklore talks about, it's probably actually the god Ishigami that confines the giant catfish. And if we do some research on Lord Ishigami, I bet we'll dig up some more on the tower and the quakes. But I'm having a hard time finding where to start. No one seems to know much about Lord Ishigami. I have an idea. Maybe this oxide girl here knows. Oh, hey, how's it going? Ask about Lord Ishigami. Brown. I know of some people who can read minds. Mister, are you the Devil Summoner Rido? Think yes. Great, I'm so lucky to have met you here in Ishigami Cho. You're the protector of the capital, aren't you? I don't you know this girl? Not really, she's just a little crazy. I'm only telling you this because you are Raido. The tower that's protruding from the earth, that is Ishigami itself. You can go inside Lord Ishigami. Oh. Go inside? You mean that tower? I heard you, I heard you, I know your secret! What the fuck? Oh, that's Ty. You're a real smoothie, ride you. Ride you? Rido. That dame wouldn't say boo to me when I tried to interview, interview her. So the tower itself is Lord Ishigami. I never thought of that. Hey, sweet cheeks. Think you could tell me more on the, of that story? I'll be waiting for you inside Lord Ishigami. Ah, oh, giving me the cold shoulder, eh? Perpeter! Uh, um, I feel violated. Come inside the stone pillar, won't you? I'll be waiting, mister. That just sounds like she's gonna rape us, really. What the fuck? 26 minutes? Wow. That that was a ghost. A, a ghost! Uh, oh, Ty, not again. You're not gonna faint. Oh, dear. I'm alright. I've got all weak need every time I saw a ghost. I'd never be able to do a job. I mean, my job. Atta girl, you held on. You see that, Rido? Ty saw a ghost and didn't even hit the dirt. Uh. Plop! What'd I say? Plop. Ah, an earthquake, huh? Well, that was unexpected. Err. Guess it was bound to happen sooner or later. Now leave it leave Ty to me, I'll take her back to the office. It's all yours then. Good luck, Rido. Go and kick some ass. The dame said we could enter the tower. Let's see if that's true. Let's see, four. There's tr three chapters left in this game. 
no, no, not three, like, no, there's four chapters left. Let's see, the next one is, I forget what happens in that one. Oh, the sixth one. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me again. The sixth one is something about, ah, uh, luck lotists. Fuck if I know. Uh, thanks for coming, mister. We're inside Lord Ishigami's body now. The tunnels below Ish it's the tunnel below Ishigami. There's so much I want to tell you, but this is only the first floor. Sorry, mister, but I need you to come to the top of the ninth floor. I'll be waiting for you. Mm-hmm. Well, might as well save here. I don't really remember how to get through this place. It's just one giant fucking maze. However, I do recall that we have to fight two fiends here. Two fiends. And, bo and uh, both of them are not nice. Bo both of them are not nice. Also remember the, the, that there were a lot of traps here too. Okay, so let's start uh, jumbling around. Enter the light. Why? No. Hold on. Okay, that's the exit. I thought this light was the exit. Enter the light. It's shouting us up. Yes. Oh, what the hell? Whoa! Yeah, that's 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 what I re that's I remember that. Those traps. Those gay little traps. Beam me up, Scotty. There's science to be done. So let's go straight this time. No rape, no Aw, oh, damn it. He raped me. Okay, well, now we know that that way is not the right way to go. So we'll go through this way. Yes, beam me up. I also do remember that there were some, like, guardian things going around here. Uh, this will beam me up. That way it will send me to hell. So, what's over here? Items! Items of the red kind! Yes. Go on, Jirajumo. Give me something nice. That's nice. That's very nice. That'll heal up anyone fully. Jindan. Okay. Awesome, now we can go back to fighting normally. So what are we gonna run into? That thing and Uko Koko Box. Fantastic. Oh wow. Whoa! No, no, none of that. None of that. None of that. Get off my dick! Too many of these bastards. He's gonna use Mudu. Yeah. Oh no, he used Makakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakakak
Resh Preesh. All right. More of this fun dungeon time. Let's beam me up. All right. That'll send me down. This will send me up again. So let's just make sure not to fuck up. All right. Okay. All right. Let's go forward. Oh, okay. Whew. I was worried there that something bad was gonna happen. Do I have a dominion? Shaman. I do not seem to have a dominion, so Juro Gumo will take the place of thought. And then we shall negotiate. So what's good, Brown? Ah uh, yes. And are you very close with this individual? Very much so. Ah, then you keep impressive company. Perhaps one day I should be counted among that number. All right, let's 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 sexy voice him up. What's good? So you're gonna stick all those legs in your ass. Let us pretend you are in the middle of a vast ocean with no compass and no light in the heavens. What would someone such as yourself do? I would search for land, good sir. So you would continue the search for salvation no matter how your circumstances. Ho oh, ho, you definitely seem like the kind of man I would like as an ally. Shall we get off this topic and go to something that you wish for? Oh, but first you must negotiate. Yes, yeah, you can have that much money. I don't think I have one. Okay. Yeah, that's right, you joined my team. For a second there, I thought he was going to run off with a ruby. I spent a lot of fucking time trying to get that thing, alright? I, I ain't going to let you run off like that. You're... You cunt. What the fuck? You nigga see this? You nigga see this? This dude. This guy. Yeah, a fucking shop. Mysterious peddler. Jesus Christ. Ugh. Oh, these, these people are so weird. Okay, I'm pretty sure if we went, like, forward, from there, we would have been, like, thrown down. I'm just saying, I, that's what I think would have happened. Hey, look, uh, one, one demon. It's normally never one demon. Thought, come on out. Juro you open this place? <laughs> Only thing he's weak to is death, which is fantastic. So let's see what else you have up your sleeve. What other demons will come out for you? Oh, just those guys. Wow. That's something. Go on, give me some love. Thank you. Commands. Let's see here. Let, let's, let's hit one of these guys with a movie, please. Voodoo him up. Oh, yeah. This is a very small platform to fight on, too. Nothing like the other stages. What? What? Whoa! Hey, human in a place like this? Looks like this ain't your day. I'm in the mood for some blood flow. Why don't you come at me a little closer, chump? Well, let's, let's go, then. Come on, let's go. What, I have a one-minute time limit? All right, that's, that's totally fine with me. So I can kick your ass in that time flat. Let's see here. Frail to fire and force. You're frail to force. Oh. Wait. Yeah, that's right. Frail to force. Looks like it isn't your lucky day. Alright. Let's hit things. Let's do things and hit him. Is there more coming? Or is that it? Is that it? Because if it is, I'm just gonna make you strike again. Wow! <laughs> Give me one minute, I finished that in like two seconds. Well, that was... That was easy. Bring me up, Scotty. 
Okay, now we gotta be careful. Or not. Black. Oh, come on. It's like frost. Black. I can't even. I can't even read that. So many of those things used one. Oh. But. No. Begin the battle. I got hit by that venom. Jesus Christ, why do these out there? Now, I understand why we can't negotiate with these things, because they're retarded. They see me killing up their boyfriends, and they're just like, Oh, yeah, I want a piece of that. Come on, let's go. 